Welcome back. New developments in the case of a father convicted of trying to murder his newborn daughter. He told police he put antifreeze in the child's milk because he did not want to pay child support. A judge sentenced that father to 50 years in prison. Shelter Station Fernandez is live in South Fulton where she spoke to the lead detective in this case exclusively today. Taisha, this was a tough case for investigators and I know for you as well to cover today. It was tough for everybody. You know, many of the investigators, Karen, our parents themselves, you know, I'm a parent myself, so everyone has just been disgusted by this father's actions, especially because he appeared to have some remorse, confessed to police, but then took it back. Today, I had the privilege to talk to the child's mother. She's not ready to talk about the conviction just yet, but she did tell me the child is doing okay. It hit home because it was an 18-day-old baby. South Fulton Police Sergeant Serta Dickerson was the lead detective on this attempted murder case back in 2020. He said seeing this newborn poisoned by antifreeze was tough. With our job, we have to really um, tap into two different places. Uh, we have to do our job. We also have to be empathetic with the parent. Um, so it kind of hit home um, based off of us trying to figure out who done it and what the motives were. It all started when Curtis Jack got his co-worker pregnant. She told police Curtis tried to get her to terminate the pregnancy for the entire nine months. Once she had the baby, she had to stay in the hospital. So she told the father to come pick up breast milk from her and take it to the baby at the grandmother's house. Curtis told police he put antifreeze in the milk because he didn't want to pay child support. That could have killed that child. Yes. It didn't. But once Curtis was indicted and faced several charges, including attempted murder, he took back his confession. So detectives and the DA's office had to work even harder to make sure the case was solid and they got a conviction. It's beyond just getting a confession. We still have to prove that the person actually committed a crime. I mean, you still have to prove that the person is guilty. Detectives were so confused by the motive in this case because they said the father had a good paying job and the mother does too. I also want to mention this. Police say Curtis Jack was engaged to another woman no. at the time all this was happening. So that may have played a role uh, in this attempted murder. We're live in uh, the city of South Fulton. Taisha Fernandez, Channel 2 Action News.